So could you, you introduce yourself and tell us why we're doing this video? Sure. Uh, my name is Tony Galenzi and I'm going to be um, taking part in the Extra Life uh, in a week and a half, which <laughs> is a, I don't know, crazy, um, which is a 24-hour fundraiser for uh, CHEO as well as other children uh, children's hospitals or Miracle Network children's hospitals. Children's Miracle Network hospitals. Thank you. Children's Miracle Network hospitals. Um, and we are going to be doing 24 hours of Dungeons and Dragons, uh, which is going to be a lot and very exhausting, but hopefully a lot of fun. Um, so do you have a personal connection or a specific reason you're fundraising for Chio? Or? Uh, I've never been, uh, like I've never gone to Chio myself or had any family who have. Um, However, I do know some friends who have gone for various reasons and have had very wonderful experiences there. Um, and I'm also currently studying uh, nursing, and uh, I hope to, in the next couple of years, once I start um, doing my placements and other things like that, I actually hope to take an opportunity to try working at CHEO and potentially, in the long run, um, work there for, I don't know, extended period of time, permanently, who knows. Um, I just know they're a very wonderful organization, and yeah, I, I think they're a worthy cause to raise money for. So we're, as you mentioned, we're playing Dungeons and Dragons. Mm -hmm. um, and what's your experience with the game? I know this isn't your first time playing, but... Yeah, no, uh, I've been playing Dungeons and Dragons probably for about two years now, I'd say. Um, as well as various other like tabletop RPGs and, and things like that. Um, I haven't been in very many long-standing campaigns, usually only a couple of months or, or maybe more than that. But uh, yeah, I've been a player probably four or five times, and I'm I have ran a couple of games. I've DM'd a couple of games, and I am currently DMing um, a game of Dungeon Dungeon World. It's called, which is similar, but um, for uh, some friends of mine. So okay, yeah. So I've, I've had a fair amount of experience. A little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, do you know what character you're playing for? Yes. This? Uh, I'm playing Eric the Paladin. Um, I don't actually know too much about him right now. There's a lot to. He's had a fairly quiet background, but I'm I'm more sort of uh, looking forward to how he's going to interact with everybody else. Um, I already established uh, with uh, with my sister Nicole. Uh, she and I have a bit of a background together. Our two characters. Um, and the session zero ended up with uh, some interesting interactions already established. So, um, yeah, no, I, I think just look forward to uh, seeing how it'll play out on game day. So, what are you specific? Are you like looking forward to, or specifically afraid of things with the game? Or um, well, I think the one thing that I'm just unsure of how it's going to work out is I've never done a game with this many people, and I don't think any <laughs> of us have. This is, I don't think I've ever seen a game done, like, like I, I'll watch some YouTube videos of games. I've never seen one with, how many people do we have, 10, 9? Uh, we'll have a max of 10 players, yeah. if everyone is there. And yeah, play. 10 Usually people. we'll keep it between 8 and 9 players, which is totally reasonable. Oh yeah, totally, that's, that's still insane, and I've never played with that many people, so I have no idea what the dynamic is going to be like at the table. How you know how slow, how fast thing is gonna play, how much conversations. So I'm just, I'm really curious to see how that's going to play out, um, as well as I'm really curious to see what the experience would be like around you know hour 22, 23, where all of us are running on very little sleep, and uh, or even when the people who did go to sleep for a little while come back in. I'm just, you know, it'll be a really crazy weird balance, and uh, there's just yeah. a, a lot of things to look forward to. So. Especially at the end, because we'll all be like just pushing caffeine, sugar, oh, anything to stay yeah. awake. Caffeine, sugar, pizza, whatever. <laughs> like it's just gonna all your be... basic student food groups. Oh uh -huh, yeah, ramen. I'm sure I'll I'll just have a couple of packs of ramen in my pocket that I'll just be pulling out when I need it, <laughs> just to get some quick energy. And... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, all it's right. uh, it's gonna be great. Excellent. I guess as a, a sign off. Just, I look forward to seeing you all on the Twitch stream and not dying. And yeah, it's gonna be great. Yeah! Woo!
So, do you have a uh, wanting no. words? Uh, <laughs> yeah. So, t- place your bets now as to whether Tony's character will survive. Oh, I'm probably gonna die <laughs> at some point. I have a Facebook page and I don't check it. I don't know. <laughs> well, you run between classes. Yeah. Okay, never mind. That's not gonna get better. It's gonna be great, and I'll, I'll definitely die. <laughs> Matching furniture. Crazy thought. <laughs> Clean house. What? <laughs> sometimes it's fun to break stereotypes, but sometimes it's fun to just you know, embrace them. Excellent. Perfect. I love the future. Ah, future is wonderful. (laughs) Yeah, it was just an amazing experience. It's what we got. I should sit on the On the printer? printer? Yes, sit on the printer. If you're watching the Twitch stream, I will be monitoring that most likely through the night. So if you want to talk to me, talk to me there. Perfect. And, yeah. Or knows? find you in the nursing program. That or or just randomly come up to me at Ottawa U. That's where I'm going for <laughs> nursing, and just say hi. Now you know what my face looks like. You can just find me, and and yeah, and we'll meet up and chat. <laughs>